Yo, what is going on everybody? It's Conventicle bringing you guys some more 2007 old school runescape in the gameplay here. We got some Jad and I was gonna get on after work and try to get some other gameplay for this video, but sadly, right when I logged on, I DC'd because the fucking lizard squad or whatever these faggots are named keep DDoSing the servers and the game is virtually unplayable right now, but uh, in the meantime, I'll just be making videos I guess, so hope you enjoy them and I've been on Reddit as you guys probably know if you saw my last video lately and a lot of talk is occurring about how the new um, OS buddy or whatever client was changed to that name rather than Orion, which is what it was previously named, and a lot of people want to know if it's safe or whatever, and as far as I can tell, I switched to it and it's the same thing. A lot of people are wondering about getting hacked or keylogged or whatever the fuck, and I can pretty much assure you guys that that's not going to happen. Pretty much uh, above 60% of the people who play this game are using that client, so, and I also use it myself, and none of us have really had any problems, and if there were problems occurring, you would probably know a lot about it. So, um, hacking wise, you don't really have to worry about that if you want to get it, but um, apparently a lot of people are worrying because they added this new thing called um, Quick Hop which allows you to hop worlds without even having to add in your login info and a lot of people are worrying about this because it's kinda like um, against the rules in the game or whatever um, like the actual third-party client rules it like kinda goes against that for uh, runescapes terms of service so um, maybe this um, client might get shut down or something like that but I know that some Jagex members actually um, work like with this client sort of so um, that may be a problem but I just want to come on here to let you guys know that I think since they actually released a official RuneScape client for 2007 RuneScape um, they should uh, decide to make some of the changes that were made on this Orion OS buddy client or whatever you want to call it to that client so I want to make some suggestions that I like on this client I don't like everything on this client and I also don't have pro because nobody will give it to me and I don't want to have to pay extra money in order to do that but um yeah I just want to make some some suggestions that should be added to the original um, main Jagex RuneScape 2007 client in order for people to actually be able to switch to playing it because this client is so worth getting at the moment because of the couple add-ons that I'm gonna list here so um, first of all resizable mode now this is one I actually made a video on back in the day uh, probably like a month or so ago about um, having a full screen or resizable mode on the game and that would help so much and they have that on Orion and or OS buddy I'm just probably gonna call it Orion because that's what I'm used to calling it I don't really agree with why they changed the name like why did they even change the name in the first place there's not really much difference um, that I can tell with so far but um I just want to say that uh, the resizable mode is great also they have XP drops so you know what you're gonna hit before you even hit it pretty much so that also helps a lot and you know how much XP you're getting and it also has an XP calculator so you can tell how much XP you're getting per hour etc um, and the next thing is the XP tracker so um, usually there's a uh, tracker of uh, uh, the amount of XP you've gotten at the top right of your screen and on this client so that also helps a lot but it's not really something too big but still XP trackers helps a lot um, next thing is a screenshot manager and it automatically screenshots whenever you get a level so that also helps a lot if you wanna like post things on reddit or whatever that also helps a lot um, also there's a special attack orb as you can see on the right next to the minimap which also helps insanely a lot and some people who PK might think it's overpowered or whatever to have it on the original old school runescape client but you gotta remember that pretty much over half the people who play this game play on the Orion client rather than just the regular runescape client or on the browser so the next thing is the default world selection on this client and you go um to reopen your client in order to get the to get to world one because you cannot actually just switch to world one when you have the client open because usually it's full so that also is insanely helpful because uh, you wouldn't be able to do that as far as I know in the original RuneScape client. Um, the next thing is the world map orb overlay. Now I don't know why they still haven't considered doing this so as you can see on the top right of my screen if I were to click on that world uh, button it would show me where 
I am in the world so that also is insanely helpful pretty much all these are and the last one which I don't have but the pro version have which I think is pretty awesome is um, it shows you if you're at a boss the spawn rate and it's uh, like fairly accurate it's usually off by like three seconds though but it's pretty helpful and it also has an uh, God Wars Dungeon Alter Timer, which is also awesome. So those are all of the things that it would probably take for me in order to switch to the actual uh, official Jagex RuneScape 2007 client. So I hope they consider these suggestions. I know it would make many people, including myself, switch from OS Buddy to the official client because of how awesome these add-ons are that they made for it. And I know a lot of people would definitely be willing to switch because of how shady many of the people who run this client are apparently because many of them used to work for botting clients back in the day and people just don't want to have any risk just to play the game with a couple of good add-ons. So anyways, if you did like these suggestions, suggestions and you gotta leave some support by leaving a thumbs up and a comment down below and I will see you guys later in my next video but you gotta subscribe thanks peace